three, two, one. Ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, this is Mr. Anderson. Anderson, and you're watching freaking Jiggy Jag TV. Loud and proud, it's Jiggy Jaguar from JiggyJaguar.com. Thank you. Good night. This will be the access intro. Okay, go. Okay. Hello there, Jiggy Jag, the board of directors of Community Access Television of Salina, Inc. Yes, I'm an official board member. Who let that get past security? Uh, we are here at the Kansas Star Arena, Kansas Star Casino in Derby, Kansas? Wichita, Kansas? Mulvane. Mulvane, Kansas. There we go. Thank you, Britannia. We should do this over. <laughs> and, uh, we should do this over, but I'm going to keep this in. And uh, thanks for watching, Jiggy Jag TV. Division, please welcome, fighting out of the blue corner from Rio Rancho, New Mexico, this is Kevin Garcia. One hundred twenty five pounds. And now his opponent, who will be fighting out of the red corner from Garden City, Kansas. This is Eric Vargas. One hundred twenty four pounds. Tomorrow night in our featherweights division, Kevin Garcia taking on Eric Vargas. <laughs> Big thanks to Glenn. Okay, boom. Second five. Let's go. Second All right, everybody. Andrew Duncan, Full Court Press host. I'm here with Mr. Vargas. He is all the way from? Garden City, Kansas, Dave. baby. So we're keeping it real Kansas. Obviously, we got Nico Hernandez here. And of course, we got Mr. Vargas here as well. You know, look. Huge opportunity. Are you feeling the weight of the situation of the magnitude of everything that's going on in your shoulders at all? I've been boxing since I was 10 years old, so there's no there's no weight right now. It's just exciting. Ready to get in the ring and do what I do best. This is what I do. Is there a moment though where you think to myself, you know, I'm a little too juiced, I'm a little too amped up, and I've got to calm myself down before I get in there? Or is that part of who you are, just bringing that energy and that emotion with you wherever you go, whether it's in or out of the ring? The, the, the amped up part is today. Then you get some good rest, come back tomorrow, focus. It's, you probably won't even see a smile out of me today. Really? It's going to be that serious for you? Yeah, it gets serious. <laughs> you know, obviously, CBS is here watching. Uh, a lot of big lights, Nico Hernandez. And at some point, does that kind of become like, hey, you know, I'm tired of hearing about this legal guy. You know what he did was great. How do I get some attention on me over here so that way people can see what I can do too? Or do you just do all your talking over here? No, not, not at all. Uh, he was great, man. He did, he did what he did for this country, got a bronze medal. So he did great. You can't take that away from him. You know, there's a lot of kids that look up to him, and that's good. That's what, that's what we need in this sport to drive these kids to come to this sport, you know, just to be a better person. Me, I just come in, do my thing. That's what 
I'm looking forward to. It's just going in and letting my fist talk. You know, with a lot of the kids that are watching, there's a lot of people that have, you know, and you've been a boxer for a long time, guys like Irish Mickey Ward, some other guys that have really deep background stories, you know, family members with drug addictions and things like that. This sport, the kind of discipline that it teaches you, is that what you seem to be drawn to the most about it? How it kind of keeps you out of those situations? Definitely. The hardest thing in Kansas is it's a small town. There's a lot, there's a lot that comes out of that town. It's a pretty bad place if you're in the, if you live in the wrong area. So unfortunately, I lived in the wrong area. But my brothers paved the path for me in boxing. My friends paved the path for me in boxing. We stayed all away from that. Look at us now. Now you're here with CBS. Oh, yeah. All right, man. Anything you want to say to the camera, bro? You just go ahead. And hey, shoot Garden there. City, Kansas, Carrizo, Texas. Love you guys, everybody. We're doing it for y'all. There you go. Thank you so much for being on the program. Best of luck to you, sir. Thank right. you. We'll see ya. Full court press. Holy oh, shit. Comes in the featherweight division. Your judges, Karen Homerfield, Jeff Sinnott, and Marcus Danforth. Number three, Tom Anderson. Fighting out of the blue court. Wearing black and gold, making his pro debut tonight. Weighing 125 pounds from Rio Rancho, New Mexico, Kevin Garcia. The red corner wearing green with a record of one win by knockout and zero losses. Weighing 124 pounds from Garden City, Kansas. This is Eric Borges. Alright, gloves all look good. Equipment looks good. It's time to wrap and go to work. Here 
derecha, en la panza. Abajo en la mera panza, en la derecha, Erika. Ahí está, ahí está. Ahí está, ahí está. Levántalo, levántalo. No te caes, no te caes la pena. Dale, dejó. La recta en la panza, ahí, ahí, la recta. Here it is Jiggy Jag TV. It is the official board member of Community Access Television of Salina Inc. Who let that happen? Thank you, Ross. Thank you, Ross. Now um, we are here at the Kansas Star Arena in Mulbane, Kansas. History begins with Nico Hernandez this evening, and uh, we are going to talk to all the fighters. We are going to talk to. We're going to show you some fight highlights. Everything. And uh, thanks to my, my guy, Bob Trigger for uh, treating us like just excellent, excellent, excellent stuff. And uh, go to the website, JiggyJaguar.com. Also, go download our app, uh, JiggyJaguar.us. And if you're on YouTube, subscribe, like, share, all that stuff. And hit the stupid bell for updates. Why there's a bell, I'll never know. But uh, thanks for watching us here on Community Access Television of Salina.